Tell about the healer. Greater is the one within a column as the leader. Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky. And I'm a wait up on the giver. He'll deliver like a dealer. To take her up y'all my name is nisha and i'm back with another video being about my father's business y'all see the title of this video so i have a word for y'all you are about to be rich you are about to be rich before we get all the way into this video make sure y'all subscribe if you have been led here to my channel make sure y'all subscribe and join the family and hit the notifications bell so you can get notified every time i upload a video okay so we're gonna get right into this video y'all where it comes from proverbs chapter 22 verse 4 it also comes from john 10 10 okay so we're gonna start with proverbs you are about to be rich proverbs 22 4 says the reward for humility and fear of the Lord is riches and honor in life. The reward for humility and fear of the Lord is riches and honor and life. Your humility is about to be rewarded with riches. Your humility, the humility you show, the fear of the Lord that you show, your righteousness. Because you have been living righteously, because you have been, because you have showcased your humility, you have obeyed God, you have went and done the things that God has called you to do, and it may not look pretty to people around you. So you've been out here looking a fool for God. You've been out here looking a fool for God in obedience to God. And you are about to be richly rewarded. You will be richly rewarded. And as I was reading this, y'all, the scripture, John 10 and 10, um, came to me. So I'm going to read that. And also, let me see, 13.93. As I was reading Proverbs, um, chapter 22 verse 4 i believe i looked at the clock y'all on my clock it says 10 10 and god has shown me this number god speaks to me through numbers in in different ways god speaks to me in different ways but on my clock y'all god has shown me 10 10 on the clock as i was in the book of proverbs and um, reading that scripture god shows me this number a lot he has shown me this sequence 10 10 a lot y'all and it always reminds me of john 10 and 10 so john 10 and 10 says the thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy i came that they may have life and have it abundantly i am the good shepherd the good shepherd lays down his life for the sheep so god came so that we can have life abundantly so that we can have life abundantly abundantly is more than enough more than enough god came so that we can have more than enough so that our cup can run over so that there's overflow so if you have been seeing the numbers 10 10 just know that life that god has promised us in john 10 and 10 that life is about to come to pass because you have you have picked up your cross and walked you have shown humility you have obeyed god you have been living in righteousness. Proverbs 22, 4 says, your reward, riches will be your reward for those who show humility and for those who have the fear of the Lord. To have the fear of the Lord is to live in righteousness. Because when you have the fear of the Lord, you don't want to go against them. So it's to live in righteousness. And I also have another word coming out um, that focuses on our finances and and how God is going to do a thing um, as far as finances goes. So I'll be releasing that probably after this one. But yes, y'all, that is it for this word. Y'all can pray over this. That's it for this word, y'all. You are about to be rich. You are about to be rich. Those of you who have shown humility, you have shown humility you have done what God has asked you to do. Even when it didn't make sense to nobody around you. Or when it didn't make sense to you. Even when it had you looking crazy. 
even when it had you looking crazy for God. Okay, but that is it for this video, y'all. That's it for this word. Make sure y'all subscribe so y'all can get notified every time I upload another video. And yeah, I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Yeah, in the fire.